Hey, uh, Chris with Cloud Computing for Kids here. Today we're going to be talking about how to design AWS for lower cost operations. So in order to design your AWS infrastructure for a uh, lower cost, you would want to use the cost optimization methodology. Basically, this is the process of refining and improving your workloads over uh, its actual life cycle. So first of all, uh, you can utilize monitoring tools such as CloudWatch, uh, which allows you to track uh, your instances or whatever you're running and measure their overall efficiency of them. Next, you can focus more on the application building rather than the actual AWS infrastructure. You can also utilize tags to help with the cost reporting to maximize the allocation of resources. And finally, you can use AWS managed services where possible to leave time for innovations. So let's say I'm building some sort of uh, program that runs EC2. So first of all, I want to ask myself, uh, do I need like a short amount of EC2 instances that like are flexible? Or do I want like a one long running EC2 instance that's like taking everything in? So if I need short uh, instances that are extremely flexible, I want to use spot instances. And these are 90% off the on-demand price. So I'm already saving costs right there. But if I need something more long-term, I would want to use uh, reserved instances, which run for either one or three years. And they save up to 75% compared to the on-demand price. So that's uh, one way you can save costs. And thank you for watching.